Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Sunday. Back from my weekend and back to doing some nice group breaks here. 21-22 Panini Obsidian Basketball coming at you. Six box, random team break number one. One spot gets you two random teams each. And the original 15 names, you'll be in uh, that promo tonight. Big thanks to this group. Let's double your names up. Oh, double up. Oh, oh. And all 30 teams are in. Let's do it. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams. Four and a five, nine times each. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Got Greg down to Nicholas. Four and a five, nine times for the teams. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. We got Detroit down to Miami. Greg with the Pistons, Charles with Cleveland, Josh with Brooklyn, Brian with Chicago, Sal with the Charlotte Hornets, David with the Suns, Sal with the Magic, Charles with OKC. Daniel with uh, Bucks and Dallas, who got Kyrie Irving what, earlier today, yesterday, today. Josh with the Timberwolves and Sixers. Greg with the Grizz, Ed with the Spurs. Seth with the Nuggets, Nicholas with the Lakers. Josh with the Jazz, David with the Knicks. Seth with the Pelicans, Josh with the Kings. Charles with the Warriors, Ed with the Clippers. Allen with Boston, Brian with Washington, Josh with Atlanta, Daniel with the Pacers, Charles with the Rockets, Allen with the Raptors. Daniel with Portland and Nicholas, Miami Heat. So let's sort by team name alphabetically. And we're gonna pause the video just for a little bit. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades, then we'll have the break. Stick around, be right back. All right, hi, welcome back everybody. No deals were done, so that list remains the same here on Sunday, February 5th, 2023. Thanks everyone for making this happen, appreciate it. And let's see what we got. 21-22 Obsidian Basketball. Fresh case, half case. Six on the left side, six on the right side. And let's roll the die and see which half we're gonna do. So it'll be one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's five. One, two, three, four, five, six. This we will save for next time. It's kind of hard to see, but I did mark these two on these boxes so we know they're, they're for the second half. Keep those back there. And good luck, everybody. Looking for two autographs a box on average. Lasers here for the uh, train whistle pulls. Yeah, out of fives and under. Get the train whistle. Let's hope to find some of those. And I think we've got two cards on the bottom and then... Those should be the autos on the bottom. we got Rudy Gobert. Franz Wagner to 99. Rudy Gobert's to 50 right there for the Jazz. That's for Josh. Wagner goes to the Magic. That's for Sal. Edwards, George, and Davion Mitchell. Not numbered. Are 
your two autos. We got RJ Hampton, 105 out of 149. Aurora autograph for Orlando. That's going to go to Sal. Love the obsidian, real sharp looking set. So I just move my microphone a little bit. And then we got Tyrese Halliburton. Nice. 38 out of 49. Lightning Strike. Autograph of the Pacers. That will go to Delo, one of his last spot mojo teams. Mets are hiring Carlos Beltran for the front office, Rex says. As a GM? That'd be surprising if it was a GM. There's Anthony Edwards, 36 out of 99. Jalen Brown. 75. Lamelo, Usman, Bam. Yeah, you got a nice Pacers edition of Tyrese Halliburton. All right, we got Volcanic Grant Williams, 58 out of 75. Oh, just as an assistant. All right. Well, cool, Mets. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to make a huge difference in anything. Uh, Allen with the Celtics. And we got Cameron Thomas. Two color patch and autograph. Uh, no Kyrie. Kyrie officially got traded to Dallas. Or is it official yet? Unofficially traded Dallas? Does it mean Cameron Thomas gets a little more time? So that's an RPA for Josh Smith and the Nets. Something to look out for in the next couple weeks. I did, Rex. Weekend was great. Went to the uh, went to the driving range with Nick and his brother. Had some dinner. Went to uh, went out to some other friends. The next night, stayed out way too late. And uh, here I am, back at work just like that. Yeah the, well, the, yeah, the Mets have spent some money. So let's see if that results in anything. Beltran being in the front office, that's kind of like non-news, really. Former player gets assigned, gets hired to front office. <laughs> that happens pretty, pretty frequently. Charles with the Rockets. And there's, uh, with the Jalen Green, there's Luca Garza, 3 out of 10, two-color patch and autograph for Detroit. That's going to go to Greg. Yeah, I do love the RPAs in this, Daniel. And then we got Corey Kispert, jersey and autograph. Kind of like what they do with little arrows in the window there. Kind of, especially with some nicer patches, it'll kind of center your eye to that middle spot. I think it's a good idea. Brian with the Wizards, 98 out of 99. All right, another box. We got a Jalen Green Tunnel Vision, uh, 87 out of 99. Lamella Ball, Volcanics die cut. And Wiggins, Jalen Johnson, Gary Trent Jr. Lamello die cut will go to Sal and Charlotte. I think it says the new Volcanic inserts. I guess maybe these might be a little more short printed. Another Jalen Green, this time an insert, a Tunnel Vision insert. 
for Hughes, another one for Charles. There is Usman Garuba, rookie autograph, rookie eruption autograph for Charles and the Rockets. Now, retired players, yeah, it doesn't. You know, there, there's a number of retired players that are in the front office for the Dodgers right now. But they end up just being like consultants, or they're not, I mean, they're not, I don't know if they're actually picking up the phone and making deals and stuff like that. People who want to go do the coaching route will often have to start at the lower rungs. Kai Jones going to Charlotte, by the way, that'll be for Sal. But the front office is a very broad. It's a very broad sort of thing, too. It doesn't necessarily even mean he's going to be working with the GM on player transactions or stuff like that. He can just be a special assistant, <laughs> you know? He could, he could be, you know, working more on the player development side of things or, you know, the farm system side of things. The front office is very broad. So it's sort of like, you know, be like a VP in a large company. What does that really mean? It's Bogdanovich for the Hawks to 99. Yeah, I mean, he might even be working with Billy Epler, to be honest with you. Front office doesn't necessarily mean just the GM. Kevin Huter for the Hawks, lightning strike autograph. 14, 34 out of 99, Josh Smith for the Hawks. 34 out of 49, Kobe White and the Bulls, lightning strike. Lightning strike autograph for Brian and the Bulls. Yeah, and Beltran was, was up for that managerial position before the scandal. So, I don't know, maybe they're sticking him in the front office for a little bit with the intention of moving back, moving him back downstairs to a managerial position or something like that. Could just be a stepping stone for that. But you kind of keep him, you know, if the Mets really like him that much, you kind of keep him in the building, right? So, could be a strategic play as well. Now, if, if the news was Carlos Beltran assistant GM well, like, was his official title, that'd be something else. That, that, would be, that would be interesting. There's Charles Basie and uh, Zaire Williams. And your final couple hits. Good luck, everybody. Jamal Murray, Bogdan Aaron Wiggins. Final two autographs. We got a JT Thor. Rookie Eruption Autograph for Sal and Charlotte. 83 out of 149. And the last one here, Duncan Robinson, 130 out of 149. Galaxy Autograph for the Heat. Nicholas with the Miami Heat. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Second half in the store. I don't know if Color Blasts are... I know they're in here, but I don't know if they're guaranteed one per case, but we didn't see one on this side. So maybe we'll see one on the other side. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.